Some Embroidery Studio product levels include Corel Draw Graphics as standard. This gives you the full range of vector creation and editing tools. In turn, this enables you to convert vector objects and lettering directly to embroidery. Individual objects or whole designs can be converted. In this video, we look at options for creating embroidery from vector graphics. First, try opening the design in Corel Draw Graphics. Optionally, choose to match design colors to threads in the current embroidery palette. Use Retain Graphics if you want to retain the original vectors during conversion. Size the artwork to approximate dimensions. It can be further scaled after conversion. Select the entire design or parts thereof and use the Convert option to transform vectors to embroidery. The resulting objects take the default stitch type, color and object properties of the converted object types. Resequence embroidery objects as necessary. Notice that the conversion process automatically removes overlaps to avoid stitch bunching. Here we generate borders as column C objects using the Simple Offsets tool. Edit and sequence the results with any of the methods available in the Wilcom workspace. A method for converting vector objects to applique is provided in the Wilcom workspace via the Convert Applique option. Size artwork to approximate dimensions. It can be further scaled after conversion. Here we use the Convert option to convert the T to applique. Press Enter. The resulting applique can be styled to suit. Here we use Smart Design to convert other vector objects. We leave out the drop shadow for simplicity. In this case, we recolor background objects and use Weld to join them into a single object. Edit and sequence the results with any of the methods available in Wilcom Workspace. You can use the Remove Overlaps function to remove unnecessary and bulky underlying stitching. Corel Draw Graphics allows you to add and format true type lettering. Contour your lettering along a digitized path. Vector lettering can be converted to embroidery lettering with the aid of the Convert tool. If you're not satisfied with the results of lettering conversion, try converting to curves first. Optionally, use Tag Fill as Turning Satin to tag objects for conversion to turning stitching. Edit the results in the Wilcom workspace with any of the available editing methods. Note that special effects, such as drop shadows, do not convert well as there's no equivalent embroidery effect. If there is no embroidery equivalent, the object is converted with solid colors only. Enveloped text is converted to embroidery objects rather than embroidery lettering. In Corel Draw Graphics, the Tag as Applique button allows you to tag selected true type letters or curves for conversion to applique. You need at least 30 millimeters of height for embroidery production and you need to choose appropriately blocky fonts or shapes. In Corel Draw Graphics, you'll need to set lettering to at least 72 points for conversion. Once tagged, use the Convert Graphics to Embroidery function to convert to applique. Both lettering objects and curves produce the same result. Adjust applique properties as necessary, including size, fabric, cover stitching, and so on.